we're back with the star of the film being the Ricardos, Javier Bardem. You're starring in, a, in another film right now called The Good Boss. Yes. And on Monday, I found out that it uh, received 20 nominations for the Goya Award, which is Spain's uh, Oscars. Yeah. Oscars, essentially. Yeah. Like they're yeah, it's, uh, we broke, we broke every record. We broke every record, and we receive it with a lot of, uh, in a very humble way, and I, we are absolutely overwhelmed. But it's it's true. It's true that it's not easy to make a good movie, and when it happens, that the critics, the reviews, and the audience is really unified on, on really supporting and and accompanying the journey of that movie because they love it. It's 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 a great reward. It it opened in Spain uh, a little over a month ago. Yes, yes. Hasn't come out here yet. What what is it about? Well, it's about basically in a few lines, it's about the, the abuse of power uh, on a working place. And it's through a very dark mm, comedy way, but also there's a lot of punches because it's a social uh, portrait of what, it, what a working place is and the abuse of power that you can do with that. And there are many examples in the world. You can start from Harvey Weinstein being uh, one of the top of the examples, and also people are have little businesses, but they are not very respectful in respecting the boundaries with their, ha, with their has, there been, has there been a substantial um, version of what we in the United States might call the Me Too movement in Spain? Yeah, well, yes. I mean, I think the Me Too movement has really spread all around the world. So, yes, it's basically the, the same, yeah. Um, now, I can't let you go. Legally, I can't let you go without <laughs> asking you about Dune. Because uh, you play Stilgar, and I've, I have a... Photo here. Look at that. that I, I keep back here all the time, not just when you're here. <laughs> um, it, I think it's 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 a perfect adaptation. It's absolutely beautiful, stunning, moving. Um, you're a perfect Stilgar. Thank you. Coming from you. No, he's, you're, you're, you're such a great Stilgar. fan. Wow. Wow. Very much his own man. <laughs> yes. You know, mysterious, honorable. Now. I did not know you were already friends, but of course it makes sense. You're already friends with Josh Brolin yes. from No Country for Old Men, yes. but you guys have Nothing. never done a scene together until this. Yes, and, and, and we don't even share the scene. He, only, he just yells at you. Yeah, he yells at me, I spit on the table, and he look, I, I look at him like, shh, shut up. <laughs> and, uh, uh, but when we heard about the news of being the sequel, the sequel happening... Yeah, just a few weeks ago, we got yes, greenlit, which yeah. Which is a great news. I, I got a text. The first text that I got was from Josh Brolin saying, see you in the desert, mother <laughs> It's like, all right. Because in the second one, hopefully, as you know, we'll have... I've read the book. And spoilers, there's a lot more Stilgar in the but second. But I have to say something to you. Yes. I personally invite you to come to a set from next summer to see the shooting of Dune, whoever, whenever you can. You're a witness. Yes, I mean it. Whenever you can. It's gonna happen in, in, in Budapest or, or, or in Jordan, in so many places. I, I don't know for real, but you have to come. I, I will I'm make in. sure that you are there and you wear one of those still suits. <laughs> okay, wait a second. What are, the, what are the still suits like? How much chafing are we talking about here? <laughs> They are comfortable. I mean, they really? did a great job. I mean, they, they, it, you're not wearing a hefty bag in the desert. <laughs> no, no, not really. It's it's they are not as heavy as as it looks. They are it's yeah. beautifully made. Well, um, did you did you come across Dune growing up in Spain? I read it when I was I'm 52. I read it when I was 18. I didn't get any of it. It's like, what is this madness? You read it in Spanish. Yeah, in Spanish. Read it in Spanish. Yes. So it, 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 but it was, it, it, it was like if I read it in Russian. I mean, it's, it's like I didn't understand a word. There's a, there's a lot going on. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm just curious, how do you say fear is the mind killer in Espanol? El miedo es... El miedo mata... Fear is the mind killer. El miedo mata la mente. El miedo mata la mente. Mm. No, yeah, that could be a very kind of... Uh, I don't know if it's a good translation. Let me see. And how would Rick... <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, how I, don't, would, I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> how would Desi Arnaz say it? Oye, miedo. Penudo miedo. Tienes que tener... Ten cuidado con el miedo. Ten cuidado con el miedo. You... Well, but I just... One thing occurred to me. I, I meant to ask you earlier is that you are a convincing musician. 
as uh, Desi Arnaz. Yes. Well, are you a musician? Because you play I, the guitar beautifully, you sing beautifully, you dance that's, beautifully. That's movie magic. That's movie magic. I don't do I don't do guitar. I, I kind you don't, of you really faking it. Yeah, I have it with these fingers. Look at this. It's like, but uh, uh, no, I, I play drums and I play congas. That, that's that, that's real. That I like. I like the yes. uh, the, the rhythm. But uh, when I was playing Babalu, that scene I really enjoy it. But because I'm not a real conga player, I bleed all the. I mean, it was like the conga was full of blood because I was. <laughs> Too hard on it. Nega, do you have any and advice? as you know, Look, real conga players also bleed. Look at me. Like, wow. That, that's normal. That's normal. That's normal? Yeah. You okay. Can, you, you can come okay. play now if you want to. <laughs> well, listen, if you say so. <laughs> but perhaps as we go out, <laughs> as we go out, being the Ricardos is in theaters December 10th. Javier Bardem, everybody. We'll be right back with a performance by Gang of You.